whale and a rabbit. It's not funny. It's pretty funny. And she kept coming back to it, comparing the archetypes to characters in some play by Aeschylus. Oh, and you haven't lived until you've heard a tipsy Brit try to pronounce Aeschylus. Hey, Aeschylus is hard even when you're not tipsy. It was like her lips were falling off. <laughs> and try convincing her that Willie Loman is not one of the characters in Aeschylus. That was a hoot. Oh, well, I'm learning so much here. She had five martinis. Five. And she got there before I did, so I don't know how many she had before. I've read things about this woman, it all kind of aligns. I did too. Her decades of breaking barriers and empowering women. Her drunken naked tirade through the glass door section at Harrods. Halfway through her third martini, she asked if she could lick my juicy apple cheeks. Ooh, do I want to know what that means? My brain is fried. Well, let's talk about something else. Oh, Condé Nast just got the message. Pushed again. You're kidding. I know I'm not their highest priority, but Condé Nast asked for this meeting months ago. This came from them. Condé Nast, procrastinator supreme. May I? Help yourself. How you doing, Rory? Long time no see. It's been a very long time. I didn't know you two were still in touch. Rory was passing through town on a job, and I begged her to have lunch. Hmm. Something better to do? <laughs> he did beg. So, what about Condé Nast? Are they dicking you around? No, just, um... Lots of postponements. You want me to make a call? To Condé Nast? You can set a meeting, make it stick. It's no problem. No, that's OK. Thank you, Mr. Hunsberger. So what brings you into town? She's working on a book proposal, co-writing with Naomi Shropshire. Naomi Shropshire. <laughs> Have some hangover medicine ready. <laughs> She's a character. But that's what makes her unique. Oh, I got to go. Um, hey, the party next week for your uncle. Is Odette coming? She will be there. Gets engaged to a girl who lives in another country. Smart girl. And Condi Nast, the offer stands. You're very nice. Thank you. I don't believe that's the first time anyone's ever said that to me. I mean, someone not sticking a ship in my back. <laughs> See ya. How did this happen? It's OK. He's seen us. As far as he knows, we're just friends. Of all the millions of restaurants he walks in here, what? Yeah, this is one of the family holdings. Of course it is. Why do you think I sprung for the $300 bottle of wine? <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> then I fell back to sleep, and the real Paul Anka serenaded me with a medley of lullabies. That's very sweet of him. I know. I feel weirdly bonded with the real Paul Anka over this. Plus, it's my third dream about him this year. What does that mean? That it's a good thing we didn't name him Mickey Rourke. Hey, have you ever heard of Dexter Schmidt? Is that a band? No, an actor. Don't think so. Tony Shaverkian? Nope. Lennox Haldolstad? Who are these people? It's a bunch of actors staying at the inn. Kind of B-level. That's mean. That's what everyone's calling them. Anyway, they bought out the whole inn. That's good. Yeah, but we should have bagged Jennifer Lawrence, right? Why are you trying to bag Jennifer Lawrence? Well, because that's who you try to bag. She's the goods. She's the goods? What is that, hotel lingo? And the ones who are here, these B-level kids. Call them something else. These younger, less credited thespians, they all use their original names. No one changes them anymore. What's up with that? Maybe they like them. Tawny Shaverkian oh. likes her name. It's not bad. My generation, we got Natalie Portman, not Natalie Hirschlag. Someone's been on the Google box. We got Joaquin Phoenix, not Joaquin Bottom. Oh, you're making that up. No. Who wants to watch Virginia McMath dance with Friedrich Osterlitz? Is that Ginger and Fred? Yeah. You sound very worked up. Are you OK? <sighs> Michelle's leaving. No, he's not. Well, he's getting restless. Well, that's just Michelle. Play him some Skrillex. That always calms him. The dragonfly was a dream, Suki, and I had. It was a pal's place. And then she left, which sucked. But I still had Michelle. And Michelle, he's, for me, what Paris is for you. Your angry friend. My angry friend. He's not leaving. How much longer are you there? Not much longer. I'll see you soon. Didi's not sick of you yet? Didi. British Didi? Oh, no. Um, not sick yet. I do the dishes. Oh, for Didi you do the dishes. I have to go. Well, thanks for letting me bend your ear. Michelle's not leaving. Bye. Well, you'd look good in a suit. You sure would. 